It's a windy and overcast morning here in Mumbai. We're up bright and early, a little too early actually if you ask me. We're here at the Nanda Villa in Andheri, Mumbai and there's a fair amount of security here and that's no surprise because the person who lives here is the boss of top security. Yes, we're talking about Dr. Devan Rahul Nanda. He is the chairman and managing director of top security and we're going to spend a boss's day out with him today. Nanda has just finished his grueling one hour long exercise regime. I'm tired just looking at him, but he's not. And uh, let's talk to him a little bit about this. Dr. Nanda, you're really into fitness, aren't you? What's, what's, about, what's about all this? Well, my business is fitness. My business is security. You wouldn't work, you wouldn't interview a security owner who's got a paunch this big or who's you know, a very slim guy. So you want, you know, you got to look like a business. And that's what I do. You have to look like a business. So you're building your brand right from the minute you wake up? Absolutely. With me and my employees, all of us, all the time. You're also into really into martial arts and stuff, How do you right? Know that? <laughs> well, I've done my research. Yeah. Tell, tell me about that. I've been uh, practicing martial arts, Jeet Kune Do. Mm -hmm. That's uh, Bruce Lee's uh, form of doing martial arts for the past uh, seven, six years now. I'm a black belt in martial arts in Jeet Kune Do and Kung Fu. I'm a doctor in martial arts from America, Indiana University. So I've been, you know, somebody asked me. Uh, you're a doctor, so what, 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 what do you do? So I said, I'm not the other, the other doctors. You know, they, they, they make bones, I break bones. <laughs> but I'm a doctor nevertheless. <clears throat> so how long have you been into fitness, right? Since you were a kid or is this no, since no. you started the business? No. When I was in school, I was, I was the most fattest boy in school, the shortest guy. I'm 6'2 now. I was 5'4 and uh, I was the most bullied child in school. When I went to college, I had to go thin and, you know, Get biceps because I couldn't pick up a single girl, you know. Nanda family has just got the God's blessings with their daily puja. It's time for some faith puja now. Breakfast time is probably Dr. Nanda's favorite time of the day. He gets to sit down with his whole family, his lovely daughters, and spend some quality family time. Let's go join them. Thanks for having us here. You're welcome. So is this a daily routine? Do you sit down every morning, the whole family, and have breakfast together? We try to do that because we've got holidays. <laughs> so that's the reason we try and make it. Now you live a hectic life, you know, work, parties, all of that. How do you, uh, how do you make time for the family? Do you have, you know? Family is like a magnet. You know, my, my kids, look at them, my kids, amazing. I feel like spending all the time with these guys. So whether it's Saturday or Sunday, mm -hmm. I don't work, come work me. Mm -hmm. And we have a written rule that when it's the birthday, mm -hmm. I, I'm not allowed to go to office, come work me. Even if uh, Chief Minister of Maharashtra or the Home Minister of India calls me, I'm not allowed to go anywhere. <laughs> so I have to be home on those days. Saturday, Sunday, I'm home. <laughs> mm. It's been a hectic morning already, but Dr. Nanda's day is just getting started. We've got a lot more ahead. We're heading with him now to the headquarters of the TOPS group. Time to get down to some serious business. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> Come. Hi, 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 hi. Morning. Morning. Morning, morning. How you go? All right? This is the command of the room center from where we control our top nine duties. Hi, Commander, how are you? Kyalin. Samugam. Kyalin, here. Alright, guys. Morning, morning, morning. That's the Command Control Center. 
from where we control and we monitor our top and activities across the, across the city mm -hmm. and top security across the country. That's Commander Bhagat. He's the head of operations. Nice to meet you, Ma'am. Nice our deputy head of operations. So how is this? Yes, perfectly fine, sir. Yeah. How is how is the how is the monsoon affecting you? Uh, monsoon has affected, but we are quite on time, sir. Okay. Yeah. Under nine minutes. Yes, all within nine minutes. All within nine minutes. In fact, in the past ten days, they huh? have done about eighty-five rescues. Eighty-five. Yeah. And I'm telling you 40, 45, eh? 85. 85 yes. Yes. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. This is the thing, you know, we, we come at the reach in 9 minutes. And now, what's the average reach time now? 7.62 minutes. Yeah, so, any part minutes. of Bombay you give a call, we will reach you in 7.62 minutes. How does it work? Explain to us how these systems Samagam, really work. How, how do you, work? how do you... Now look at the, that's the GPS and the GIS. <laughs> From here we can track all our brigades and all our more, you know, patrols across the city. So, you see all the circles and all those triangles? You see all these blue circles all the time, that's for Bombay. So when you go more and more deeper, the triangles you see on top, sorry. These triangles are the motorcycles, the patrols. Mm -hmm. And these circles are our life brigades, the ambulances. So how does it start when a call comes in? Okay. So a call comes in over here. This is the software. Is that the receiver? Yeah, this is the dispatcher. This is the dispatcher. Where is the receiver? The receiver is there. That's the receiver. So that's the receiver there. So when he receives the call, that's the receiver there. Yeah, 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 yeah. We receive a call. We fed a database inside, so all the three and a half members are fed inside. Mm -hmm. So automatically, if a call comes, the, the data of the customer comes over there. Mm -hmm. So you know the customer location, the customer name. <coughs> you know his blood groups. You know his uh, his ailments, his uh, uh, his photograph. Everything comes on board. So you know exactly where he's calling from also. So then these guys feed it in. They say right, helps on the way. These are dispatches. So automatically it goes over there, the software, and all these on over here. They, pardon me? Yes, you can do the address will come in. Yes, yeah, there. So that's, that's the emergency of medical. So we got the full details of the address over here, the name, the caller number, and we know exactly which of the brigades where. Yeah. So this is, your circles are the brigades, like I said, the triangles are the patrols, and we know exactly which is the nearest one. So according to the nearest one is dispatched. And then on, on, the, on the radio, from here, and from here and from there, they coordinate and they make sure the person reaches the right place in, in seven and a half minutes. training do your people go through to make sure that they are ready and able to tackle any difficulty I out think, there? I think the Brigadier Jasingani has been with us for the past five years. He heads India for training. Why don't you answer, Brigadier? Uh, guards are training for 10 days at the site. First seven days training, we train them in all subjects like physical training, mm -hmm. drill, parade, as well as all military subjects. Mm -hmm. That is, entry vehicles, how do you fill in the registers, how do you deal with first aid, how do you deal with firefighting? All the lessons are taken in the first seven days. Uh, Dr. Nanda, you're pretty much in all of the segments right now. You're uh, doing man security, you're doing electronics. Uh, what are your most profitable segments right now? Where, where is your focus and what are the other segments that you could possibly look into expanding the business? Good question. You know, we, we, we look at providing... Uh, the, the customer today has become very educated. Eh? Mm -hmm. You just can't send them, you know, we give you only to man guarding, we do investigation. Mm -hmm. The customer requires a holistic solution mm -hmm. to a problem. Mm -hmm. So if you've got a risk, let's say NADP, you've got a risk, we can't just say we give six men. Mm -hmm. So you've got to understand risk, do an audit, understand threat perceptions, yeah. then look at covering your risks or eradicating or mitigating your risks mm -hmm. by providing you man guarding, investigation, some security systems, mm -hmm. could be some, um, some uh, uh, other services that we offer from our stable. Mm -hmm. But eventually it's a holistic solution. Mm -hmm. But if you ask us where are we the most profitable, I think our biggest focus lies on man guarding. Okay. So uh, like I told you, we've got six group verticals, yeah. out of which five group verticals, out of which man guarding, the guarding group is the biggest vertical. Uh, how about going public? Tell me about your going public. Uh, Tell me when that's happening. Of course it's happening, of course. We've got Rakesh Jujumala on board now, who's, who's, a, who's, who's one of the biggest investors in the country. And uh, we've also got another very big investors come on board now. 
Another very big company is looking at acquiring some more stake in tops. So yes, uh, next year, next next year, we will go public. We have to. We should not immediately, you know, offer three million. We should, we should look at doing around 25 to 30 million. Initially, we looked at offering them 60 million. That if they don't achieve what we expect them to achieve, and they right. achieve the basic, what the CAGR is, what the growth of the right. And how much? How much? We end up paying.